What's up guys? Today we're gonna go out into the field and we're gonna do some trend shopping, all right? Because I wanna show you uh, some trends that are going around and I'm gonna show you how you can reproduce them like that. So without any further ado, let's get on down these streets. Ah, uh, nothing like the hustle and bustle of New York City, right? So we look and see what they're selling on the street. Then we go inside and we take a look at some nice little sneakers. But you know what? We want to get over here to the good stuff, the T-shirts. So we come up and one of the first things we see is this one. All right. And you can see it has the cherub with the eyes poked out, the good and the evil, which is going to be a theme. Let's keep it moving. You can see we have the angel with the eyes crossed out. Then we mosey along and we get to the hood rich section. And then we see this one, nice little logo with two, can you see those? Two doves, let's keep it pushing. And then we see something else right here. This has the uh, left chest and let's flip it over with the big back. All right, that's a cool one right there. Another angel. Now let's go over here. Look at this one. Get money with a cherub. All right, I think I'm gonna redo this one. Let's take a closer look. We got a hem tag and a neck label. Now let's go over here. What else we got? Okay, we have a rose. Trust nobody. All right, let's keep it pushing. Okay, about enough of this place. We're gonna leave out of here and we're gonna go over to Jimmy Jazz. I was in here in another video. And see, I have standard stuff, Michael Jewelo. Uh, let's take a look at this. I showed you this one before, and yes, it is an angel, right? Or a cherub with the mask on, good and evil. All right, we got another angel with uh, a gold chain, you know what I'm saying? The urbanization, and, and, a, and a bandana, the urbanization of the angel. And you have this right here, Born to Trap. Uh, this is, don't be a loser, guys. Do something with your life. Anyway, let's keep it pushing. Let's go over here. Uh, the champ is here. Uh, I kind of like this one, you know. It's got all the money and the trophy. The champ is here. All right, then we're going to look up here. It says, pray for my ops. Uh, Hip-hop is destroying everything. Anyway, we have the skull and roses right here. Really cool. So the trends are kind of like this. Birds and angels. Birds, an birds angels, duality flowers so let me show you how you can make stuff like this for your t-shirt line hella easy i'm gonna go over to kiddo let me put on my glasses right and you can go to templates you can go to uh t-shirts and you can begin to take a look you can also put in keywords like if you notice a lot of these trends have to do with like angels and cherubs right so you can go right here and put in cherub or cherubs and boom look at all of these i mean this literally looks like the stuff we saw in the store all right i actually went through and i saved a few of these so let's go over here i saved a few of these right look at the i mean this looks like i mean virtually looks like we're shopping in the store right so let's take a look you know what there was something that hood rich thing with those doves and i'm going to show you how you can do something so simple check this one out right here so we can click and click again all right so here we go right here. We're going to turn this into something. We're not just going to bite styles. We're going to have an interpolation. Okay. So let's go to layers, dove graphic. We're going to go all the way down to the background. We're going to change it to like a white. Look at that. And we really might not even need um but first things first so instead of truce we're going to go over here to headline text it's going to add a headline and we're going to write we don't want to put something like hood rich at least i don't 
and well, we're gonna leave it black. What font are we gonna use? Text. What font is this one? We're gonna use that same font, American. Let's get rid of this. Add a little arc to it. So we're gonna go down here, transformation, and we're gonna hit arch. And we're gonna we don't want it so severe, so we can go right there. Look at look at how easy. Look at how easy that is. And uh, what are we gonna do? Are we gonna so you know what we're gonna do? Um, I'm gonna go over here to uh, elements. Let's see. All right, allows. Is that? Yeah. 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 Click right there and then click right there. Look at that. We got a t-shirt just like that. Let's do another one. This one right here. Look at that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go over here to our elements and we're gonna look. Let's see if we can. We're gonna and we're gonna eye drop it by clicking the color, then going right here, and we're gonna click this right there, and we're gonna take that and we're gonna hold that down. Like that and we're gonna put that over his eyes. We're gonna make it a little. Almost done. And we're going to take this uh, dreams and we might just move this over here. We're going to take this circle. We're going to put it around this money right here. Let's grab this. Let's change it like that. And we're going to take this. We might, we're not, we're going to leave that right here. We're going to take this. I'm going to pull that down to be in the center and just gonna write dream. I like that dream. So we're gonna get right dreams right here. We're gonna use one of these, uh, one of those gothic fonts. Which one are we gonna use? Then we're gonna uh, use something called headstock dreams. We're gonna add another little bit of little bit of arch to it. We're gonna bring that arch down. We're gonna bring that. Bring that up some. As opposed to dream, we're just gonna write dream. Make that bigger. And right here, I'm gonna write B I G. Like dream big. Well, let's make this bring this to the front. How about that? So you know what we're also gonna do just to make that dream pop out. I made I copied and pasted. I'm pull it over here. I'm gonna grab the other one and I'm going to make that one. My eye drop the background color. I'm gonna make that one black. And I'm just gonna put this. So we're gonna make like a drop shadow just to make see that just to make that pop out some more. And we have ourselves a T-shirt. All right now. Let me show you, because I don't want to make the video too long. Let me show you a couple of more that I did, similar to what is already in stores using Kittle. So I did this one to look like that one that we found at the store. And remember the one, the skull? We did this one. I did all of these using pre-existing templates, but what I did was I changed them up a bit. You don't want to use them exactly how they are. You want to change them up a bit. And guys, that's how you do it. If you want to know more about Kittle, there's going to be a link down in the description box and check out this video. It's an actual Kittle tutorial. I explain everything, but until next time, I'm going to put some butter on my shoes and slide on out the door. All right. Start a t-shirt business of that trying. I'm out.
Peace. T-shirt help, Brusk. You can design. Oh, oh, I messed up.